In this example, we'll be explaining what is strictly dominant strategy, strictly dominated strategy, weakly dominant strategy and weakly dominated strategy. Okay. Now, supposedly there are two players, player one and player two. Player one has two choices, A and B. There are, these are two strategies which are available to player one and player two has four choices, C, D, E and F. Okay. And the payoffs of player one playing A are something like this. This point is to show whatever payoff is of player two. Like this. Okay. Now, supposedly, if player one plays B, then the payoffs say they are. something like this. Now in this case, no matter what player two payoff are, when player one chooses A, it gets a higher payoff in every situation. You can, you can have a look at this here. It has a higher payoff in every situation playing A. We are not even worried about what are the, what are the payoffs of player two. Okay. Given these payoffs of the first strategy of the, of, of the strategy A, player one is never going to play strategy B. Fine. So what have we concluded from this? When player one chooses A, it gets higher payoff in every situation. So this is, in this case, we can say that A strictly dominates B for player one. Got this? Now, supposedly, if we would have made this payoff in a little different way, so let us make it, make it like this. So every payoff is same. Yeah. So as you could see, when player one chooses A, it gets these pay, he, he gets these payoffs playing A. If he plays B, he gets these payoffs. He gets equal payoff in these three situation, but only in this situation, he gets higher payoff from playing A. Okay. So even if there is only one payoff, which is higher and all other are equal, then the strategy, which is giving a higher payoff, only in one situation is going to weakly dominate the other strategy. Okay. Well, it could very well be the case that in two situations, it is giving you higher and the other situation, it is same. So it is the case where A weakly dominates. A weakly dominates B. The other example could be where all of them are equal. That is the payoffs from playing A and B to player one are equal. So you could say A is equivalent to B. Got this? 
So in this example, we have learned how to identify strictly dominating strategies, weakly dominating strategies and equivalent strategies.